Oh, okay, I know, I know. It sounds insane. It, it it sounds like it has to be played by like five people, and it's just two guys. And one of them is going to show us how to do it. Are you ready? I mean, you're not, but I'm going to do it anyway. In the YouTube reaction system, certain videos must be reacted to by highly trained specialists. Unfortunately, we only have this idiot. All right, let's take a look at this. All right, so this is Chris. And Chris is the lead singer and uh, the guitarist for a band called Torrential Rain. Uh, I know he likes a, writes a lot of the music, a lot of the lyrics. Uh, he is a guitar uh, a duo, uh, part of a guitar duo with a guy by the name of Gordy. And the two of them, probably two of the best guitar tandems you're ever going to find. Now, they are an up-and-coming band. I've been following Torrential Rain now for almost three years. They were the first up-and-coming band to ever reach out to me. Hey, oh, we like your uh, reaction videos. Would you mind checking out one of our songs? And I said yes. And ever since then, they've been a part of my channel. Love these guys. They are in that elaborate, modern, metal core, progressive metal community of bands in Germany um, that is really second to none right now. There's so many bands from there. Hostage, Avalanche Effect, Our Mirage, Torrential Rain, and the list goes on and on and on. And every time you turn around, there's another one. Uh, the entire area is saturated with musicianship. Don't believe me? Watch this. This is Chris doing his portion, his guitar parts, for a song uh, called Eye to Eye. It's from the new album, Digital Dreams. Please check out this album. Because I can promise you that even if you don't like this song particularly, let's say it's just too complex for you. That's okay. You can go check out a song like Faults Are Thick or Love Is Thin where it's literally just fun. And they have songs like Aporia, which are just as complex and maybe even a little heavier than this one is. You never know what you're going to get with Torrential Rain. All I know is that Chelsea and I were in a car for four hours driving from our home in Lafayette Houston, Texas, to see Dragon Force. And we listened to Digital Dreams for four hours straight. Why? Because we wanted more. And we were going to see Dragon Force. Yeah. All right, watch this. Go, Gordy. I got to be honest with you uh, real quick. Yes, the song is without the vocals. Okay. So I've listened to this song many, many times and I love the song with vocals. It's a great lyrical song. Here's the catch. There's so much involved in what appears to be at least three guitar parts. He's playing two of them at any given time, but I do, you could still hear some parts that Gordy would have laid in here. And I'm sure they share duties on this song that you don't really notice with the lyrics because the lyrics are so powerful and they are so perfectly laid into this arrangement that you do miss some of the details. And I'm really enjoying watching all these little details as he literally sits on an amp plugged in in a warehouse parking lot. 
in a parking lot. Such variations and compositions are so different. Soulful building metalcore, just modern progressive. It's everything in one song. You can feel it, Bill. There's no lyrics, and you can feel it. You know it's coming. I don't know if you need the bus or the ambulance, dude. Cause, man, that was, yeah, that was outstanding. So, hey, look, let, let's let's just get down to it, okay? Um, Chris does an amazing job, and I I this is one of the songs that I absolutely love on the album. This is the first time I've heard it with no lyrics, and I knew that the guitar parts were central to the way that the song is portrayed vocally and I always felt like the song really moved properly together nothing seemed like it was just thrown like anything was haphazard but then without the lyrics you can still hear the story you can still feel the story progressing and moving rising to conflicts ebbing down to the silent lows and, and building itself back up to a crescendo This is Digital Dreams is on my list for album of the year 2023. It's on the list. So, um, and it's not just because I love these guys. It really is one of the best albums I've heard this year. And I've heard a lot of really great albums. We've been blessed this year. 2023 has been a year of amazing albums, but this one definitely it's on the list for the year for sure. All right, everybody. My name is Old School Nerd. I please do me a favor. Listen to the album one time. If you don't have at least two songs that you're like, I need to put that on my playlist. I need to hear that again. I can't help you. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed this video, give us a like. It really helps the channel grow. Also, if you want to subscribe, right there. 
Big thank you to all my Patreons out there. We appreciate everything you do. If you want more content like this video, check them out above. Remember, love one another, take care of each other. We're all stuck on this mud ball together. We'll see you later.